Hello, this is Anton Fakori uh, discussing uh, fractures of the metal phalanx in the PIP joint. Uh, this is a young lady who uh, slipped and fell, uh, injured her right small finger, and what sounds like an axial, uh, direct axial load. You can see that uh, the uh, right small finger has diffuse swelling and ecchymosis. Uh, there's a pronation deformity. You can see the small finger is rotating inwards, and if we flex the fingers, can you flex them for me? Open up a little more, right there. You can see that the ulnar uh, deviation of the right small finger, as well as the pronation uh, deformity. Um, and if you look at the uh, X-ray, we see that uh, there is a fracture of the pro uh, proximal interphalangeal joint. Uh, it's an intraarticular fracture, which. Uh, uh, it has a depression of the volar lip of the uh, middle phalanx. This is a pilon type uh, injury uh, and it's uh, significantly comminuted. Uh, this is a fracture where uh, it's not really amenable to uh, good reduction in emergency room settings. She will uh, need uh, surgical intervention, but if she has significant deformity and tenting of the skin, it would be a good idea for you to reduce it and put in a splint. And the best way to reduce it is just uh, we can demonstrate the uh, with the adjacent finger is just uh, simply uh, apply traction and remember it's in pronation, it's simply supinate to neutral position and then place the metacarpal phalange joint in flexion. Uh, the splinting is uh, something like this, a clam digger type where we're going to flex the MP joint and extend the phalangeal joint. This is what's a one step, we already uh, allowed it to harden and, uh, and then right after we splint the under two digits. Maintaining uh, the radial digits for a lot to allow her to use her right thumb and index finger for day-to-day -day activities. She should follow up within a day or two to, uh, for uh, definitive treatment, which may include surgical intervention. Uh, ask her to elevate as much as possible, and uh, may need surgery. Thank you.